Hello, it's April and welcome to my toy world. Today I have some more Schleich Bayala figures to open up today, as well as a really fun play set in the back here, the Library Blossom set. So that is another one of the Blossom style buildings and this one is a library. I love books, so I definitely thought there should be a library in my Bayala collection. I also have some of the new fire and water unicorns to share with you as well as this beautiful Pegasus. So lots of really fun figures to open up today. Let's take a close up look first at all of the unicorns and Pegasus and then we'll get them out of their package and take a closer look. So this is the Elementa fire unicorn stallion. So a beautiful fire unicorn. I'm so excited. This uh, unicorn looks so beautiful. Then we have the Elementa water uh, unicorn here and the water unicorn full. So very, very beautiful. And then this is a Pegasus stallion. This is a decorated, beautiful Pegasus stallion. So I'm gonna go ahead and open up all of these figures now, take them out of their package so we can take a close up look. Okay, so I have these all out of the package here. Let's go ahead and start with our fire stallion. I think that this is so beautiful. His hair is so pretty. It definitely looks like fire. It's slightly translucent. I just love the look of that. That is so pretty. Looks like the hair on the back of his legs is sort of flowing off like flame. He's sort of an apricot colored, peachy colored horse with lots of dark orange detail. His horn is also dark orange with some gold glitter. This is a really, really fun design. I was really happy that they came out with some new designs of unicorns here. I love the idea of fire and water. So these are just incredible. I really love the flame style of his mane and tail. And then I have here the beautiful unicorn water mare here. Look at her mane and tails, the bubbles in her beautiful blue hair with silver glitter details, some stars there. Her little blue unicorn horn also with silver. Her beautiful light watery blue colored body. Again, her tail has the bubble detail and stars and silver glitter. Silver glitter on her hooves, or the bottom of her legs and hooves are a dark blue. Her face has a little bit of the dark blue as well. This is so pretty. I love the bubbles. This looks so pretty and will match some of our um, mermaid uh, Bayala figures as well, I think. So again, picking up with the water theme there. I think that that's so beautiful. And here is the little water full, unicorn full. The mane here has some little teeny tiny bubbles sort of worked in to the mane and tail there along with silver glitter, some ombre, color on the uh, body of this unicorn here going from light to dark blue. Again, sort of hair off the back of the legs kind of flowing off like water might do. Little tiny cute unicorn horn there. And here we have it from this side. This one is a little difficult to balance. It keeps kind of wanting to tip that direction. Um, has to be balanced just so. So we'll have to work on its legs a little tiny bit. I usually don't run into that with Schleich animals. They're usually balanced so nicely that they stand perfectly. But I did find that to be the case with this little tiny foal. That's okay, we can work with that. And again, so, so beautiful, the water and fire theme. I do hope that they come out with more of the uh, different water and fire. Perhaps they'll come out with more elements, perhaps some plant life or rocks or something like that. I know that in the Eldrador series, they have a lot of fantastical creatures that are based on the different elements like fire and water and stones and things like that. So I'm hoping that they'll pick some of that up a little tiny bit with the Bayala too. These unicorns are absolutely beautiful. So I'm really happy with those. Those are newer and I'm really happy to be adding those to my collection. Next we have this beautiful decorated Pegasus here. This is a stallion and he is so beautiful. A really pretty color of um, body here, sort of the light tan with the beautiful brown tail and mane. Lots of leafy details. I love it when the Bayala figures have the little leafy details like their little forest creatures. Got some braiding and glitter detail in the mane there. 
The tail is long and flowy also with some glitter. The beautiful Pegasus wings are a light blue with a tip, a little bit more of a turquoise color and really pretty turquoise glitter. Let's take a look at his face. So, so pretty. And again, with the gems here, they're sort of a turquoise colored gem and a little purple flower detail, some sort of copper colored metal there. That is a beautiful Pegasus. Next, we have our library set. I'm so excited to open up this set. Again, I love books and libraries. And this set looks like so much fun. I love the little owl creature that it comes with. It looks like it comes with some gems there and the fairy here running the library. Here on the back, it shows everything it comes with. Again, this is one of the blossom style of houses. So it closes up into like a flower blossom. It comes with a little bookcase, it looks like, some stickers, a key, a fairy and an owl. Here are some of the other ones. We opened this one up also in a recent video. And here's the inside a little bit more and how it opens up. So that is really, really pretty. I'm super excited to um, go ahead and put this together. So I'm gonna go ahead and get this out of the box and I'll give you a close up look at what it looks like. Here are all of the parts here. You can see the instruction booklet in the back as well as some sticker sheets here to work with. So now I'm going to go ahead and follow the instructions and get this library put together. Okay, so here is the Blossom Library all put together. You can see all of the fun details here. And this cute little desk here that opens up. There's a lot of little foam stickers like there was in the other Blossom playset. Um, so you can take these little foam stickers, they're repositionable and you can put them around in the room. It also has this cute little uh, pretend light here hanging up that I really, really love. And of course, it also folds up into that blossom shape. But let's go ahead and open it up and we will add our cute little owl here, the library owl. And then we have this beautiful fairy here with her parrot and she can hold on to her parrot and visit the library and do her work at the desk, which I think is really, really cool. The Blossom Library playset also comes with this really beautiful gem, sort of a beautiful turquoise aquamarine uh, pretend crystal there. Another fun item with this playset is this little drawer right here. So this drawer opens and closes. This little dial here, you do have to kind of press it hard. It tends to want to lock in place. There's a little locking mechanism and it did come with a key, but I don't really see how to use the key um, to open this. But if you just turn it like this, you kind of have to push in and then turn it. That determines if this drawer is locked or not, which is kind of fun because um, when you get it back into the correct position, to be able to open it. Let's see if I can dial it back to that part. And here we go back to the right spot so we can open our drawer again. So I'm not sure if the key is just for fun um, and you do have to use quite a bit of force uh, to get that to turn. Perhaps you're supposed to use the key here to kind of press and turn, which uh, could be what it is. But anyway, I thought that that feature was really fun. You could hide little uh, treasure down in there. And again, this desk is so cute with its open and close feature there and the fun little light up here. Just think that this is such a fun set. And again, with its little crystal here and this adorable little owl. So definitely a very fun set of wonderful Schleich Bayala toys. I absolutely love the Pegasus, the uh, water and fire unicorns and unicorn foal, as well as this really fun Bayala Blossom Library set. I hope you enjoyed taking a look at these wonderful Schleich Bayala items today. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll talk to you later. Goodbye.